What's up fellow Pyros? It's Pimp Daddy 28 here and today I'm going to give you guys a little sneak preview to a fireworks demo that I plan on doing on July 3rd. Um, the reason why I'm going to be doing it that late um, is because uh, since I live in Ohio um, I'm limited to blowing off fireworks on the day before, day during, and day after the 4th. Um, if I blow them off any other day I'm pretty much asking for trouble. So uh, that's pretty much the reason why I'm um, setting it up for that day specifically. And as you see here, um, I have six shells total, four from the Spirit of Liberty kit, a single, double, triple, and quad break, and two canister shells, one electric grain and one Excalibur. Now for the Spirit of Liberty shells, I kind of picked them out at random. I wasn't going for a specific effect. Um, but if you guys uh, want me to replace uh, one or more of them with or another shell or swap them out, um, just let me know. Um, as you know, I, I posted up a video that shows the shell description for each shell in the Spiro Liberty kit. Um, if you go back to it, um, if you see any shell that you uh, want specifically um, to be put in to this demo, just let me know and I'll be more than happy to swap it out. But for now, um, these are the effects that are that I have fused together right here. Uh, for the ball break, it's purple stars with silver glitter. For the double break, it's purple stars and silver glitter with green stars. And uh, for the triple break, it's red stars, gold glitter, and blue stars with flying silver flying fishes. We got a nice flying fish effect on that one. And for the quad break, it is... Um, get the focus. Okay, here we go. Silver palm, red palm, green palm, and crackling. And for the canister shells, uh, for the electric green, I have red wave uh, with crackling. And for the Excalibur, I have red wave with crackling pistol. Now, um, if you notice, um, I picked uh, both shells out with uh, very similar effects, if not the exact same effect. Um, I did this um, because if I had picked out just a random shell from each kit, it would have pretty much defeated the purpose of comparing it. Um, I noticed that way too many times uh, people on YouTube uh, take uh, one shell out from another kit and another shell out at random to compare, and then you get into this whole debate about which one's better and this one's better and vice versa. I did it this way so that we can see the complete difference between these two shells. So um, this is something um, that I intended uh, to put in this demo from the get-go. It's actually the main motivation for me to do this demo. Um, I figured I just would include the uh, Spirit of Liberty shell since there isn't any video of them on YouTube whatsoever outside of the WF Boom demo, which is um, not, not as, as good as uh, one that you might see in person. Um, as you notice, uh, I fused it all up with uh, Perfect Fuse, and, um, oops, you know what, let me put the shells inside the tubes. There we go. Get that quad break in there. Rain. Finally, the Excalibur. All right, as you notice, I used uh, Perfect Fuse here, and um, which burns off at 10 seconds uh, per foot, and I used exactly one foot, I believe, uh, measured out for this fuse. Um, and uh, if you notice the tape, if it looks familiar, that's because it's the u-haul box packaging tape aka dave's magic tape from display fireworks one channel i'm pretty sure you've seen him use um this tape in pretty much all of his demo vids um i've used other forms of tape in the past it just hasn't worked out it's the first time i picked this up um so i'm hoping that it'll work out a lot better than the other ones that i've used and i'm pretty sure it will since it hasn't really failed anybody um in terms of the their, their own demos with this tape uh, being used. And uh, just to include this, this is the uh, Perfect Fuse, uh, big Perfect Fuse. I'm pretty sure you guys are familiar with this. Um, now one thing um, 
that I didn't include in this uh, demo or in this uh, thing that's fused up is the uh, the can one inch canister shell from the Spirit of Liberty kit. Um, that was also in the kit, and um, I decided that I'm just going to blow one off by itself. And as you take a look here inside uh, this box full of shells, um, this is the one that I took apart in uh, the unboxing video, the shell description video, if you remember. I just put them in this box here, and um, I decided that I'm going to use uh, this one here. Um, it's the Spanish gold effect, and if you might have guessed, I picked it because of the name. Um, even though I've blown these shells off for about four or five years now, I never really looked at the effects each time I uh, attempted to blow it off. Um, I just grab the shell and just throw it in the tube. Um, and a lot of times the stickers, because they're so loose, they tend to fall out. You never really notice that the descriptions on there to begin with most of the time but uh, this time I'm around I'm gonna make sure I, I figure out or I just read the effects so I know which one is which so that's pretty much it um, next month I'm gonna be making uh, my final uh, trip to WF Boom and then I'm around that time I'm gonna make a final stash update video so be on a lookout for that video around that time all right see you guys later